and you are praying. You are praying. Those, those people are that are listening to you. Use that, 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 use Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. Amen. Amen. Yes. Come and bring here. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. God is faithful. So we are going to amen. Yes. Yes. Amen. First Samuel 28. The Bible was talking about the 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 um, witch of Endor. Hallelujah. I'm going to read from one. Amen. The Bible says, First Samuel 28. It said, Now. Hallelujah. Now. Amen. It's not talking about uh, when Saul was doing it. It was talking about now. It is talking about now. It is now the present time. Amen. God is speaking to us about now. Amen. 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 En God spreekt over nu, over het nu, de tegenwoordige tijd. Er wordt nu gesproken door God tegen ons. Amen. Now it happened in those days that the Philistines gathered, hallelujah, their armies together for war to fight with Israel. And Achish said to, uh, and Achish said to David, you surely know that you will go out, amen. You will go out with me to battle. You and your men. So David said to uh, David said to Akish, Surely you know what you your servants can do. Amen. And Akish said to David, Hallelujah. Akish said to David, Therefore I will make you one of my chief guardians for uh, forever. Hallelujah. Now Samuel had died. Amen. Samuel is dead. Samuel is the prophet. Samuel is the prophet of God, amen, that God was using to speak to Saul that it was the oracle, amen. It was through him, he was a prophet, it was through him, he was talking to Saul, hallelujah, but now he is dead, hallelujah. Amen. Samuel, Samuel was aangesteld door God, hij was een profeet van God, hij was een oracle van God, en hij sprak tot Samuel, tot Saul. Hallelujah, amen, but now, Samuel has died and all Israel had lamented for him and buried him in Ramah, in his own city. And Saul has put the medium and the spiritualist out of the land. Hallelujah. Then the Philistines gathered together and came and encamped at the Shunon. So Saul gathered all Israel together and they encamped at Gilo. Gilba. Amen. When you read, uh, Samuel has died. Amen. He has died. When Samuel was alive, David destroyed all the mediums. Amen. Scatter mediums. Hallelujah. Destroy witchcraft. Send them ablaze. Destroy it. Amen. Why? Because there was a prophet. Amen. That was backing him up. That was hearing from God. That was a coverage for him. Amen. But now, that prophet is dead. And now, the Paul uh, so wanted to hear from God. Amen? He wanted to hear from God, but God refused to speak to him. Amen. And Samuel, he was gestorven, but before he was gestorven, was he a prophet of God. He spoke to David, and David had all the Midianites vernietigd, all the hexerij and the tovenerij. And now David is dead. Amen? Amen. 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 I'm not just saying it. When he wants to bring problem, trouble into a country or a generation, he used prophets. It was prophets throughout. And now there are also prophets in our generation. Amen? Amen. There are some instructions God will give to us. Amen? Amen? 
when we take it lightly because we think we understand God and we know God for ourselves, but God has chose to use that person to speak to us as a prophet. And if we dishonor it, we dishonor God, no matter how we pray. Amen? No matter how we say we are doing it. When we dishonor the voice of God through a prophet, we are dishonoring God. Amen. En we moeten, de, we moeten de stem van een profeet moeten we respecteren. Wat een profeet spreekt. Want het is de stem van God die spreekt. En, wa, en wanneer we niet de instructies doen die, die de profeet aan ons geeft, dan, dan geven we geen eer aan God. Amen. Halleluja. Amen. 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 Then the Bible said that the Philistine gathered together and came and encamped. Amen. Amen. So now there was war coming. Kalaba shekete brokoso. There was war. They were gathering together. They were going to fight. And normally, so we just go and ask prayer somewhere. What happened? This and that and that. And somewhere we say, this is what God said. This is what that God they said. But now, there was no prophet to tell him the heart of God. There was no prophet to say what God is about to do. Amen. Amen. You see, when God said the prophet to you, I tell you something, know that because God have you in his mind. Amen. Hallelujah. It's because God loved us so much. He sent a prophet. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Most of the time we just think, oh God, may God have mercy. Amen. Amen. His mercy is what makes him speak through prophets. Amen. Het is de genade van God die, die maakt dat de, 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 de profeet tot je spreekt. Wanneer instructies aan je gegeven worden, dat betekent dat God aan je denkt. En hoe er oorlog werd gevoerd tegen, tegen Saul. Saul wou van God horen. Hij wou vragen aan God wat hij moest doen. Maar God sprak niet meer tot hem. De Bijbel zegt, when Saul saw the army of the Philistine, he was afraid. And his heart trembled greatly. And when Saul inquired of the Lord... The Lord did not answer him, either by dreams or by Aaron or by, by prophets. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So it's not just, uh, you see, <laughs> when, when there are some times we are praying and when we don't hear God, it's not because he don't want to speak to us. Is there something blocking us from hearing him? Is there a baggage? Is there, is, is there, is, is there something? Amen. That is blocking us from hearing the voice of God. Amen? Amen. Because God speaks. Hallelujah. If he don't speak to you directly, then he should talk to about you to prophets. If he's not to prophet, then when preaching is going on, amen, it has to be about you. But now, most of us, when preaching is going on and it's about us, we get angry. Not understanding that the thing that is going on now is the mercy of God. He's talking about your situation without you even telling it to the person. But because he loves you, amen, that is God speaking, amen. So what we do is to rejoice and apply it in our life instead of seeing it the other way. And then seeing the preacher. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. It is it is mercy of God that God speaks to us. Amen. He didn't hear him. He couldn't hear him anymore. Then what did he do? Amen. 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 En soms bidden we, en soms bidden we, maar dan horen we God niet. Maar als we God niet horen, dan, dan betekent dat een profeet tot ons moet spreken. En wanneer een profeet tot ons spreekt, wanneer het woord naar ons gebracht wordt, dan moeten we ons verheugen en blij zijn. Maar dan moeten we weten dat God aan ons denkt. Amen. Halleluja. Amen. Halleluja. Amen. You see, Paul, uh, Paul believed that he was, when we see God, when he fast and pray, he will hear God. It is not always fasting and praying that will make you hear God, because then it will be by your works. And it's not by your works, amen. It's by the mercy of God. So prophets, they have that anointing. It's by the mercy. They don't need to fast to hear. They can hear without fasting. Because it is an unction that was given to them by the grace of God. Amen. So Paul so thought, ah, let me try. So he didn't hear God. What did he do? He changed. He went to eh, the witch. The witch. The witch. Amen. amen. The witch of Endor. You see, there are times, amen. You see, the Bible says rebelliousness is as witchcraft. You don't have to go to the witch to hear, to do something. But when God speaks to you and then you rebel against it, it's already witchcraft. I need us to understand that, amen. In the body of Christ, you see, sometimes we are praying against ourselves without knowing that we are the one carrying that seed of witchcraft. Disobedience, amen, is as witchcraft. A 
Amen. So when God says something over and over again, you refuse because you think that you know more. You take it sluggishly. You do it anyhow. You don't even care. You just allow it to be. That's disobedience. That's rebellion. And the Bible says rebelliousness is as witchcraft. Amen. En wanneer de instructies aan je gegeven worden, maar je weigert om het te doen, het is als hekserij. Want het woord van God zegt ons dat, dat, dat rebellie, dat ongehoorzaamheid, ongehoorzaamheid is als hekserij. Amen. Halleluja. So he went. He went to this woman. He went to this witch. He went to this witch. Why? Because he wanted to hear, have access to the spirit realm. He wanted to hear God, but God does not talk anyhow to people actually, amen? You have to have a relationship with him. You have to be his child, and you have to go deeper to hear him clearly, amen? So, he went now. You know, that's why in this earth, a lot of people go to witches, they go to medium because they think the way of the Lord is difficult. But let me tell you, God is a very, is a, is a very just God. He's not a difficult God. He's a loving God. He's a kind God. He's a sweet God. If you if we calm down, we obey him, we honor him, he will speak. Amen. En God spreekt, God spreekt wanneer je gehoorzaam, wanneer je gehoorzaam uh, bent naar hem. God is een rechtvaardige God. En wanneer je gehoorzaam bent, dan spreekt hij tot je. Maar Saul, die hoorde God niet. En wat deed hij? Hij ging naar de heks toe. <coughs> Om te horen. Halleluja. Amen. So he went to the witch, hallelujah. Why? Because God has not spoken to him. Hallelujah. It's like you are serving God, you are serving God today. He didn't do what you want him to do, then you run to Satan. You start doing things outside the will of God. Hallelujah. That's what this is. Amen. He went to a witch and so disguised himself, put on their put other clothes, and he went and two men with him. And by and they came to the woman by night. And that is why we are gathered here together tonight. Amen. Amen. It is at night these witches and wizards, they gather together. It is at night that God has given them access to do their wickedness. Of course, they do things at night. They do projection from night. They do it in the morning. It happens in the morning, but it is at night that they have legal ground to do wickedness, to do witchcraft, to eat blood, flesh, to drink blood, and to do all type of wicked activities. So, Paul went to her at night. Amen. En Saul die vermomde zich en hij ging s'nachts ging hij naar de heks toe. En dit is de tijd dat die heksen en die tovenaars bijeenkomen. Dit is hun legale grond, hun legale tijd waar ze hun hekserij en tovenarij doen. En daarom zijn we bijeen vergaderd. De Bible said it disguised. You see, those people behind the scene, those bar priests, those witches and wizards, those of them using marine spirits, using water to do witchcraft. You, it is only by the grace of God you can see the real person. Most of them disguise. They can use somebody that you don't like. If you are angry with somebody that you know that they serve God, they can also use their face to manifest. They are disguised. They always hide themselves. They cover themselves with, with, with when they do their witchcraft so that it takes people so many years to find that. Oh, so it is this person that is doing witchcraft against me. But when they get born again, then God will expose it to them. Hallelujah. Or they go to a prophet. Amen. Yeah. But for before you will find out, it takes the grace of God. They hide. They disguise, just like Saul. He disguised himself. He took two men with him. He went at night. Amen. En Saul die vermomde zichzelf. Hij vermomde zichzelf. En zo zijn die heksen en die tovenaars die hekserij tegen je doen. Ze vermommen zichzelf. Ze willen zelf iemand, iemand gebruiken die je niet mag. Die je niet mag. Ze willen die, die, die persoon hun gezicht gebruiken. Maar ze vermommen zichzelf. Ze, 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 ze verschuilen zichzelf. En het kan er jaren voor duren voordat je erachter komt. Het is de genade van God dat je erachter komt. You see, why did Saul went to which? Amen. Because he wanted to know about his life. He wanted to know about the future. Amen. And then he, he called, he went, hallelujah, and called a name of a child of God that is already resting. Amen. You see, when this enemy is fighting, as long as you're a child of God, amen. Hallelujah. Amen. For the fact that you're a child of God, hallelujah, that already provokes satanic power to carry, to look for, to use your name, to call your name, and to raise up somebody from your foundation or from the 
street or from the neighbor, just because you serve God, there is always a, already a war. Amen. 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 I mean, Saul is uh, Samuel is dead. Why are you still going and, and, and asking about him? Asking, bringing his name to a media. It was not because he wanted to hear from Samuel alone. It was because he wanted to know things about his life. It was him gaining from it. Hallelujah. So these witches and wizards, as long as they are the one in power, as long as they, want, they are the one manipulating, as long as they, want, they are the one that is, you know, getting something from that thing, making sure that that person's life is destroyed, trying power, checking. He said to him, what did he say? He said, go search for me a woman, a witch, a witch, who is inquiring about you? Who is going to witches and wizards to look about you? Who is carrying a, 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 a calabash and putting water and using witchcraft book and doing incantation and praying to see you, to know things about you, to inquire about you? Amen. En welke heks en welke tovenaar? Want, want Saul die deed navraag, hij deed navraag bij de, bij de heks van Endor. En, en tegen, een kind, tegen een kind van God, over een kind van God. En dat was Samuel. Wie doet er navraag over jou? Wie gaat er naar een voedselpriester? Wie gaat er naar een medium om navraag te doen over jou? Amen. Halleluja. Amen. 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 You see, Saul has lost it. God took the glory away from him. Amen? So now he's no more relevant. Hallelujah. Those people that seek, that go to look for witches and wizards, hallelujah, it's because they, their own life is done. They don't have anything to show for. Amen. So then they don't want others to go forward. Amen. Yes? They don't want others to go forward. They rather be everybody is like them. So when nobody have, when I don't have it, nobody will have it. So they like to oppress people. They like to keep people. Ah, you went to Holland, right? Yeah, I will see what you will bring back from Holland because they are not. They they are somewhere in some place that they are not moving forward. Oh, you bought a house. I will make sure these are, these are people that those things that they know that when they do that thing, amen. Is to bring the person down. People that bring people down is because they are already down. So was done. God took the crown from him. God refused to hear him. And why? Because he was disobedient. He wanted to do the work of the prophet. He wanted to be in the shoe of Samuel. He wanted to. He went to buy his, 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 his body and uh, uh, sacrifice. Where Samuel said, "Don't do it." Eh? Before Samuel came, he wanted to do it so, and then God got angry with him. Eh? And then God told him also, go fight war, kill everything. All also children and everything, he disobeyed God. And that is why God left him. And now he's seeking for witchcraft. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters, the Holy Ghost, amen, don't leave us. But we can shut him down by disobedience. En Saul, en Saul die was ongehoorzaam naar God. Hij was ongehoorzaam naar God. En daarom had God de glorie van hem afgenomen. Hij was niet meer relevant. En omdat hij niet meer relevant was, ging hij op zoek naar een heks. En zo is het ook met mensen die heksenrij en tovenarij tegen jou doen. Ze zijn niet meer relevant. Dus wat ze gaan doen, ze proberen, er alles, van, ze proberen alles aan te doen om jou naar beneden te halen. Omdat ze zelf al beneden zijn. Amen. Halleluja. People are wicked. Amen. Amen. Yes. The Bible said... The Bible says the heart of men are wicked and this is desperately, is deep and desperately wicked. Hallelujah. Amen. So, uh, nine. Then the woman said to him, nine, eight. So Saul disguised himself and put on other clothes. Hallelujah. Amen. That's the, that's the other clothes we are talking about. The clothes that God gave to him is no more on him. Now he has other clothes. That, the, clothes the glory has been taken away from him. Yes. So what he does now is to disguise people and attack people that still have glory. <laughs> and he went with two men and him and they came to the woman at night and he said, please conduct a sense for me and bring up for me the one I shall name you. Hey, Jesus. At night. He said, bring up to me. You see, this is 
deep. Because you know, at night when we are sleeping, at night when we are resting, it is possible for witches and wizards to come, go to the evil altar and start invoking our spirits. That is what this actually means. Somebody that is dead, you know, when you are sleeping, actually you are dead. Your, your, your spirit is not dead, but your body is actually done. And the only thing that is alive is your spirit. But which is God is telling us that this wicked power, even if you are sleeping, you are tired, they can still invoke your spirit. What this man was calling out, what this woman, this witch was calling out was not the body but the spirit. They do it now. They still do it today. While people are sleeping, the enemy goes so tired and went their way. At night, when somebody is resting, they do incantation. They can call somebody's spirit. They can call it with their name. They can kalabushi kataya. They can sit on the altar and start calling somebody's name. Anywhere, they are calling your name. Yeah. Calling your spirit. Yeah. Calling your children's spirit. Yeah. On the evil altar. Yeah. The Holy Ghost fire. Yeah. Holy Ghost fire. Yeah. Holy Ghost fire. Yeah. Holy Ghost fire. name I'm giving to you now. Yes? Bring him up for me. The one I shall name to you. So they take our names. They do it by names. That's why we go review those witches and we say, ah, sometimes call their name. Yes. <laughs> you see, he said the name I'm giving to you. They don't, when they go to the voodoo, when they put the name on the altar, they, they, when they, want, they don't write uh, somebody. They write the name. Your, the name. They write it and put it there and start invoking somebody's spirit. That is what this is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And that's when your name also gebruik, so can your name gebruik om hekserij te doen. But weet ook als als the name jou wordt gegeven van degene die hekserij tegen je doet, weet ook dat je daarmee kan bidden. Amen. Hallelujah. Nine said. Then the woman said to him, Look, you know that Saul, what Saul has done, how. He had cut off the mediums and the spiritless, spiritualists from the land. Why then do you lay a snare for me? Hallelujah, please. Then, the woman says, spiritual from the land. Why then do you lay snares for my life to cause me to die? And so I swear to her by the Lord, saying, As the Lord lives, no punishment shall come upon you. Then the woman said, Whom shall I bring up for you? And he said, bring up Saul somewhere for me. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. When the woman saw somewhere, she cried out with a loud voice. Amen. Anywhere, when they call our name, when they are doing incantation, when they are doing witchcraft, Amen. let the thunder of God strike them. Amen. Amen. Let the thunder of God strike them. Amen. Let them be blind. Amen. Let them be deaf. Amen. Let them be consumed. Amen. Let thunder strike. Hallelujah. You must scream. Hallelujah. With a loud voice. And when you read for that, when Samuel, Samuel stood, came out, he released curse. Causes of death upon the person that I went to make him to be invoked. While we are sleeping, by the power of the Holy Ghost, Incantation, voodoo, witty, yes. bad priest that try to invoke our spirit. Amen. Ah, Father, as they call our name, may thunder strike, may thunder strike, may thunder strike, may thunder strike. So, David, uh, someone said to him, to Saul. This today, you will meet me in the land of the dead, he said to her. Him. Eh? Since you love to curse, since you refuse to let me have peace, since you are busy calling names for witchcraft, since you call me out, eh, call my spirit, invoke me, disturb my peace, hallelujah. 
By this time today, he said, that Saul and his sons will die. Hallelujah. Oh, God has given us such power. Amen. Such power. The Amen. Bible says, so far not the witch to live. Amen. 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 Whether it's the witch doctor or the person that went to the witch, paid their money to invoke our spirit, to call our name. Amen. Hallelujah. May God visit them Amen. by judgment. Amen. May God visit them Amen. by judgment. Amen. Amen. En we hebben de kracht en de autoriteit gekregen. Het woord van God zegt ons, we moeten een heks niet laten leven. We hebben de kracht en de autoriteit om ze te laten sterven. Amen. 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 We cannot allow this witch to live. Amen. Amen. The Bible said it very clearly. Amen. Amen. That Saul, uh, Saul couldn't hear God. His glory was taken away from him. It was not going good in his life. So the next thing is to go to a meeting. When it's going good in your life, there are people that are jealous, believe me. There are people that does not like it. Some people can be jealous and just gossip it and when go their way. But there are people that will go that far to, eh, to, 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 to visit a medium. To go do witchcraft. To actually take somebody as a as a topic, as 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 a a a a a a, 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 a what would I even call it? As 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 their as their own uh, job, as their duty, because they don't have it. Others cannot have it, and when they can find witchcraft to manipulate people, they will do it. There are many people that are drunk at now. There are many people that are smoking weed. There are many people. Those people, most of the time, which somebody has brought their name to evil altar. There are mad people walking on the streets. Oh, yeah. Some people did it with their own hands, but most of the time, <laughs> eh, they have somebody, they have hurt the wrong people. It is very dangerous to be hurting people there and there. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. Spiritual. Spiritual realm is a very dangerous realm. And if that's why God said that we should be strong in the power of his might. Amen. Amen. En het woord van God zegt, we moeten krachtig zijn in zijn macht. Er zijn heel, er zijn heel veel mensen die we op straat zien, dronkaards, uh, 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 mensen die verslaafd zijn. Maar het is of door hun eigen hand gebeurd, of, of het is omdat iemand hun naam naar, 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 naar een heks of een tovenaar heeft gebracht. En weet dat er mensen jaloers zijn op jou, wanneer het goed gaat in je leven. Dat ze zo ver gaan zelf, dat ze naar een medium gaan, dat, dat ze naar een voedselpriester gaan, om je naar beneden te halen. Omdat hun leven zelf niks meer waard is. Amen. Hallelujah. This, this, this. Which from Endor, hallelujah, is, 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 a, is a woman that used, Endor is a place, is a, is, 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 a, is a place, those old in this is, is Hebrew, is somewhere in Hebrew, amen, Hebrew, is, she's a Hebrew woman, amen, yes, and you see, um, this Paul, I mean Saul, that threw out this witchcraft before, he was the one that bind it. And now he went back to invoke it. Why? Because now he needed something. Amen. That is why it's very, very... You see, you can't trust human being. <laughs> Amen? The only person you can trust is God. Amen. It was the same person that said there's no witchcraft in this place. So far, there are many people, hallelujah, that won't serve God, that are now carrying the seed of witchcraft. They have backslid it. Oh, yeah, it, it is the hard truth. Oh, God did not give me this. God did not give me that, so I'm, I'm not doing any God. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pray in my heart. I'm going to do it alone in my home. I believe God through the... Oh, oh you better run. Run when somebody become like that. The Bible says don't forsake the gathering of the brethren. They don't have a church. They don't have a pastor. They don't have anybody to tell them do this or do that and follow the word of God. Nobody can rebuke them. They are their God. They are their prophet. They are their Jehovah and Jehara. Jairi. They themselves and I. Amen. These people, you run. Hallelujah. 
Amen. En Saul, Saul was degene die, die die waarschijnlijk en hekserij uit het land zelf had verbannen. Voordat hij zelf, voordat hij zelf nadat hij God niet meer hoorde, dat hij zelf ging naar de waarschijnlijk. En zo zijn er ook mensen die, die, die eens in God geloofden, maar, maar teruggegleden zijn en, en weer naar de wereld zijn gegaan. En je moet rennen van zulke mensen. Mensen die zeggen, oh ik bid in mijn hart, oh ik ben mijn eigen profeet, ik ben mijn eigen God, ik ben mijn eigen Jehovah. Ren weg van deze mensen. Hallelujah. He said, seek me, a woman. Amen. He told his servant, seek me, a woman who is a medium. Who is a witch. Who can do, who can raise somebody that is dead. Who is seeking me for us? Which power, which power is following and attacking us night and day? And who is behind that power? God did not hide anything. Eh? It was somebody that invoked, that went to the witch. Amen? Amen. It is somebody that is watering the altar. Let's be honest. It's not the spirit. It is somebody that watered the altar. It's somebody that is praying with the altar. It's somebody that does not like us. It's somebody that wants to play God in our lives. I'm not saying we should fight against people because the Bible says we do not fight against flesh and blood. But principalities and powers. But if you know those people, bring them to the altar of God. Amen. In prayer. Amen. Don't just think of the oh, and blindly let them kill you. Amen. En Saul zei: zoek mij, zoek mij een waarzegger, zoek mij een heks. En, en hij zocht naar, naar een persoon. En we moeten ook weten dat het, het, het gaat niet over een geest, maar het gaat over een persoon. Weet dat er een persoon is die jouw naam naar het altaar brengt. En, en wanneer je dat weet, uh, het woord zegt ons, we moeten, niet, we moeten niet strijden tegen vlees en bloed, maar tegen overheden, tegen machten. Maar als je weet wie die persoon is, breng die persoon naar het altaar van God. Amen. 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 Yes. They have choice. Let them stop or die. Amen. Amen. En ze hebben een keuze. Laten ze stoppen of sterven. Amen. 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 Stop or die. Amen. Stop of sterf. Amen. One of you two. Because I'm not going to allow you to play God with my life. Amen. And I'm not going to allow you to play chess with my destiny or the destiny of my children. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Stop of sterf, want ze gaat, ze gaat niet toestaan dat je met haar leven speelt, of dat je God over haar leven wilt spelen, of dat je met haar of haar kinderen speelt. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The witch of Endor. Amen. And the Bible said us very clearly, so far not the witch to live. Amen. 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 So as we stone those witches and wizards to death Amen. today, stand up and hold that stones of fire. Amen. And be stoning them. Amen. Whether those witches are animals, they are women, they are man, or their goats, or dogs, or Amen. children, let that fire reach them. Amen. 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 Let that fire reach them. Amen. Let that fire reach them. Amen. You see, when we do all night prayer, I am not ready to be uh, doing another prayer. That's why I'm happy with the prayer that they bring also. We are in warfare. Amen. Amen. The Bible said they gather. It was at night. Amen. As we are talking... You see, this scripture God is giving to us is by His Spirit. Amen. We that is hearing about it, God is talking about one of us. Amen. Or our children, or our loved ones, our family. Amen. 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 That, that, that your son, that is behaving straight, there is a witch behind it. Amen. There is a curse behind it. Amen. There is a person behind the shame. Playing chess. Kalabashi, kalabatakata. With their lives. Halleluja. Amen. En het woord van God zegt, we moeten een heksie laten leven. Dus als we vannacht bidden, hou die vuurkolen, hou die, hou die vuurkolen, hou ze vast en stenig de heks. Stenig de heks, want, want die, die zoon die zich vreemd gedraagt, of die familielid die zich vreemd gedraagt, er zit een heks achter. En laten we die heks doodstenigen met vuurkolen in Jezus naam. De Bijbel zegt dat hij she invoked the spirit, the, a ghost. Amen. That's, that's the spirit, that spirit. Yes. We all human beings, we have spirits. Hallelujah. He, that's why you can see somebody wake up from the dream and they can start behaving strange. Nightmares. Oh, that's, 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 that's spirit manipulation. That's, that's, that's some witchcraft happening. That's why you see somebody, they can be sleepy, they can't wake up anybody. That, that's, that's witchcraft. Busy. They don't come. To, they don't come, come and carry your body.
body from the bed. They invoke the spirit. They call the spirit. And then that spirit actually, if it is not filled with the fire of the Holy Ghost, all oh, that spirit will stand up and come and appear in their mirror. And then they can throw arrow, or they can start pursuing them, or they can start saying incantation. That's why sometimes when you are sleeping, you can hear some people calling your name. Yes. Oh, that is witchcraft. That is incantation. Yes. This is real. Amen. 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 En daarom de geest van Samuel die werd opgewekt. En zo kunnen heksen en tovenaars kunnen jouw geest ook opwekken. opwekken. Daarom zie je wanneer, wanneer bijvoorbeeld mensen slapen en ze worden wakker, dan, dan, dan gedragen ze zich vreemd. Of ze hebben nachtmerries. Er zit hekserij achter. Er zit hekserij achter. Amen. Halleluja. Amen. Amen. Witches. Witches. They have white witches. They have red witches. They have black witches. They have different, different witches. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. The white witches are the occult. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Are the occult people that do uh, uh, Illuminati. Yes, the black witch, which is his voodoo witchy. And the red witch is is, uh, is in the part of the Islamic witchcraft and the Buddhists. Kalabasita Malakata. Yes. And they are all very, very against Jesus. Amen. Amen. Jesus is the light. Amen. And it is only in the name of Jesus Amen. these demons can flee. Amen. It's only in the name of Jesus. Amen. And that is the name that is above our name. Amen. We are not ignorant of the device of the enemy. Amen. We are not afraid of them. Amen. God is just exposing the fact that we cannot just allow them to rest while we have the higher power. Amen. So far, not the witch to leave. Amen. 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 Let us give Jesus a clap of free. Amen. Amen. We are going to pray. Amen. Amen. We are going to pray. In the name of Jesus, Father, any medium, any uh, medium, marine spirits. Yes, the Bible said it very clear that it was a woman who is a medium. Amen? Amen. A woman. He didn't say it's a spirit who is a medium. Do you understand? It was a woman that was busy invoking the spirit. Amen? Amen? You see, everything that is in the Bible, there is nothing like old. That is why when you pray from the Bible, it is very powerful because the Bible says, command me. God says, command me by my words. Amen. It doesn't matter how other people paint it. Uh, with, with, uh, they start having revelation. Well, keep your revelation to yourself. Let me pray the word of God. Amen? Amen. Amen. Pray the word of God. And if God don't want us to know it, he will not show it to us. Amen. Do you know how many times they, pray, they, they try to kill Bible and Bible keep popping up? Amen. It never dies. It's for me and you to know the truth. Amen. So never allow anybody to say, uh, don't pray so far the witch to live. It's in my Bible. So I will pray it. Amen. Stone them to death. Yes, I will. Amen? Amen. Yes. Uh, uh, that shall, we are not fighting against flesh or blood. Yes, we still pray that one. Amen? Amen. Eat your own flesh, drink and blood. It's all of them there. Amen? Amen? We are praying everything. Amen. It's Bible. Amen? Amen. Anybody that tells me don't pray the Bible is a witch. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Yes. Amen. What? <laughs> I'm going to carry my Bible. I've been looking at it with one hand. Let me just be. Let me just hold it even closer. I can't trust this person. Ah, no. <laughs> my goodness. Everybody that is angry, that was, uh, and they don't do it now. Stay. Don't. Uh, amen. Amen. So, but let me pray my Bible. Amen. So far, not the witch to leave. Amen. <laughs> Let's go to Leviticus. We'll stick up to that first. Okay. Let's, amen. Rachel, you are letting me laugh. Amen. So that is it. Amen. We are going to pray. Amen. Amen.
Father, every power, man or woman, that is using medium, that is using marine spirit, that is using wood, that is using wind tea, that is using any type of witchcraft to manipulate me or my children or my loved ones, Father, may that medium of witchcraft they are doing be consumed by fire. Amen. Be consumed by fire. Amen. And Father, that person behind the scene, Amen. visit them by your judgment. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Vader, we gaan bidden in de machtige naam van Jezus. Elke persoon die heksen rijk tegen ons doet, tovenaar rijk tegen ons doet, voedoe tegen ons doet, elke waarzegger, oh Heer. Vader, vernietig hun werken die, deze, die ze tegen ons doen in de machtige naam van Jezus. En vader, bezoek die waarzegger, bezoek die voedoepriester, bezoek ze vader in de naam van Jezus. Every power, they are using to manipulate us. Amen. Amen. Manipulate, Amen. hallelujah. Amen. That's the point here, because when he called somewhere spirit, yeah, when he called somewhere spirit, he was expecting to hear something else. He was expecting to hear, oh, you are going to win the battle, you are going to do this and that, but it was cost that was released upon him. Amen. That it was, he, he died the next day. Father, any power using witchcraft to manipulate us, eh? any, Father, let that power consume by fire. Amen. Let that amen. manipulation be terminated. Amen. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. That's why I believe. Shakala Rashe. Rabada Rai Shakala Rabade. Rabada Rai Shakala Rabo. Abdala Rabada 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 Rabada
We gaan bidden, vader. Elke altaar die is opgewekt tegen de leden van Gorbachev. Om vloeken over ons uitspreken. Vader, laat het teruggedraaid worden. Laat het omgekeerd worden. Laat die vloeken omgekeerd worden naar zegeningen in de naam van Jezus. En vader, degene die erachter zit, laten ze in de stress schieten in Jezus naam.
Nee. We gaan bidden voor de leden van Gordon. We gaan bidden voor, voor onszelf. Vader, dat ieder die heksen, heksenrij, tovenarij tegen ons doet. Die onze geest opwekt, onze namen roept. Voor kwaad vader in de machtige naam van Jezus. Breng ze een bezoek, o oh vader. Breng ze een bezoek. En laten ze buigen. Doe iets verschrikkelijks, o oh heren. Dat ze buigen in de naam van Jezus. When they call our children name, may God do something that they buy. Before we allow God to do something for now. The Bible says, suffer not the witch to live. 
Hein? C'est hein? la Vertikus. Amen. Let's go to the scripture. Amen. Les Vertikus. This scripture, ah, before I used to use it a lot. Now Amen. I use it, but when I just go for it, I use this a lot. And my God, every time I stone them to death, the next time they come and fight me, and then I stone them to death. It works. Amen. Pray with the word of God. Amen. 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 Don't let anybody confuse you that uh, you are not uh, merciful enough. Amen. You are not merciful to God. That's what happened to Saul. God said, kill all the people. Amen. Kill the children, kill all of them. He was the mercy, merciful than God. <laughs> hey. You see, when we start, demons that need blood, you can't give them oil to lick. They want blood, they want blood. And when God said, kill them, and you are petting them, they will deal with you. You are not, we, none of us can be ever merciful than God. So let us just please pray the word of God. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. The Bible said, it said, and you shall, uh, it's, it's, uh, 27, and, uh, Leviticus 20, 27, a man, is there, right? A man, not a spirit. Amen. And the, when you go to uh, uh, Ephesians 6, uh, 10, 12, 11, 12, and all that, but that is talking about spirits. Amen. Yes, we fight that not against flesh and blood. Amen. Then we use that one to pray against not flesh and blood. But here it said, a man. Amen. A, or a woman who is a medium. You see, even if we deny it, they are there. They are there. Or you want to, anybody want to say they don't know there are witches? Even in your family, you know they are there. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Amen. So there's no need to be denied this word and be pretending. Amen. Amen. And be leaving them so that they can attack the new generation. You, if you are the one you hear, yeah. be out, my dear. <laughs> be pitying them. They will not pity the new ones that are rising. A man or a woman who is a medium or a woman or who has familiar spirit shall surely be put to death. They shall stone them with stones. Their blood shall be upon their head. Amen. Amen. Thank God, though, that is not a reality. If a big man like Goliath is a witch, <laughs> amen, and we have to be throwing stones. <laughs> amen. One slap. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. What type of stone are you going to use to stone his head? <laughs> Only the stone of the Holy Ghost like David. Amen. amen. When the man, the man is a gym man, eh? he's pumping his muscles. And they say he's a witch. <laughs> and he says, I must enjoy this man with muscles. Very tall is the one that attacking you with witch. I would just say, well. <laughs> well, what can I do? What would be would be? Amen. <laughs> because then I'm starting, maybe what am I going to do with a guy with a very big muscles? Thank God is not my stones. <laughs> Thank God is not my, my three blows. Even if not, people like Naomi are. Ah, that is looking so slim and beautiful. Ah, all of us will be holding the Rutsalah. <laughs> Why the <laughs> Amen, God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. That God is not my uh, tongue. She's tall. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank God. Amen. Amen. She friended that is looking so cute. Amen. Amen. She would not even come out of the house. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank God is not my stones. Uh, carry big, big stones and throw it. Thank God is by the Spirit. Amen. 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 So, Father, the witch to leave. We are going to pray, Father. We stone them with stones of fire. Amen. Amen. Let fire, bring stones of fire. Horrible tempers is their portion. Wherever they gather together, Amen. let there be rain of fire. Amen. Wherever they are hiding, Amen. wherever they are doing their meeting, Amen. in their covert, let there be stones of fire. Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name. Father, het woord zegt, laat een heksie kleven, Vader, met God. Vader, we stenigen ze met vuurkolen van 
te steen, Vader, in de macht genaam van Jezus. En overal waar ze bijeenkomen, Vader, bij God, laat vuur, laat vuur op ze neerkomen en ze verstrooien en vernietigen in de naam van Jezus. Amen. Amen. I see in the spirit that they are here, they see us, they hear us. Amen. And they know we are praying. Amen. 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 Yes. Amen. Amen. So pray. Amen. Amen. Because what we are doing here, here is spiritual. Amen. As you stone them to death. Amen. Amen. They will feel it. Amen. 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 Why? Amen. Because when you are not in the spirit, when they come and attack you. Amen. Uh, you can also feel that they did something. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So they can feel yeah. as you pray. Amen. 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 Remember that and stone them. Amen. Amen.